What's up guys? In this tutorial, I will show you how to create a Gmail account without using a phone number. If you've ever been frustrated by the phone number requirement when setting up Gmail accounts, you're not alone. Fortunately, there's a way that lets you bypass the phone number verification and create unlimited Gmail accounts. The first thing you need to do is head over to the Google Cloud Skills Boost site on your browser at cloudskillsboost.google. The link will be in the video description. This platform offers training for Google Cloud, but we'll be using it for a different purpose. Once you're on the Google Cloud Skills Boost homepage, the next step is to sign in. At the top right of the screen, you should see the Sign In button. Click on it. When prompted, select Sign In with Google. This will take you to the familiar Google Sign In page where you can use your existing Google account to log in. Once you're at the Google Cloud Skills Boost page, look at the Explore button and click on it. This will bring up a variety of courses and resources. Scroll through this page until you find an option labeled Format, with a small arrow next to it. When you see Format, click on the arrow and then select Lab from the options. After you've selected the Lab option, scroll down until you find a section that mentions a Tour of Google Cloud Sustainability. This is the lab that we're going to use to generate our Gmail account. Click on Start Lab to begin. The lab will start loading and you'll be presented with some credentials including a username, password and project ID. These are essential for creating the Gmail account, so keep this page open as we'll need it to copy and paste the details in a moment. Now, open a new tab in your browser and go to YouTube. Make sure you specifically open YouTube because the next few steps are tailored for this platform. Once you're on YouTube, go to the top right corner and click on your account icon. A drop-down menu will appear. Select Switch Accounts from this menu. When prompted, click on Add Account. When you click on Add Account, you'll be taken to a screen where you can either sign in or create a new Google account. You see an option to enter an email or phone number, but don't worry, we'll use the credentials from the Google Cloud Lab instead. Go back to the tab with your Google Cloud Lab information. Copy the username from the lab page and then return to YouTube. Paste this username into the email field and press Next. Now, go back to the lab page and copy the password. Return to YouTube and paste this password into the password field. You can click on Show Password to make sure you entered it correctly. After that, press Next to proceed. Once you've entered the lab credentials, it will take a moment to process. After a brief wait, you should see a welcome message indicating that your new account has been successfully created. At this point, you've just created a brand new Gmail account without using a phone number. You can repeat this process as many times as you want by starting a new lab session each time and generating fresh credentials. To confirm that everything worked, you can now head to your Gmail inbox and sign in with your new credentials. You'll see the usual welcome email from Google and you can start using this account right away. Keep in mind that, since this account was created through Google Cloud Labs, it functions just like another Gmail account, but the credentials were generated automatically. So you didn't need to provide a phone number during the setup process. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.